This is the pin diagram of CD4066. This IC has 4 bilateral switch. As you can see here, the switch 1, switch 2, switch 3 and switch 4. These are the two pins of the switch. If you make this pin as input, then this should be output. And we can control this switch by this pin. So whenever this pin, that is pin number 13 is 1, then the switch will work as a closed circuit. And when this pin is 0, then this switch will work as a open circuit. To control the second switch, we have to use pin 5. For the third switch, we have to use pin number 6. And for the fourth, we have to use pin number 12. For the practical, we'll use plus 5 volt to the pin number 1 and the load to the pin number 2. As a load, we'll connect an LED. In the practical, we'll control this LED with the pin number 13. As a power supply, we'll provide plus 5 volt and pin number 7 to the ground. Now we'll see this in breadboard. Here, this is the IC 4066. As we know, pin number 1 and 2 are the pins of switch 1 and pin number 13, it is the controller. Now providing plus 5 volt to the pin number 1 and with the pin number 2, I am connecting the load. As a load, I will use an LED. Positive pin is connected to the pin number 2 and with the negative pin, 220 ohms resistor is connected. Pin number 13, it is the controller and with this, we have to connect a pull down resistor. It is 10 kilo ohms. Now whenever this pin number 13 is connected to the positive, this LED will glow and whenever it is connected to the negative, this LED will turn off. Okay, now connecting both the positive and negative rails. Connecting the power supply, here it is negative and the positive. Now I am connecting this pin number 13 to the positive rail. Here it is glowing and whenever it is connected to the negative, it is turned off. So this is how this switch works and in this IC we have 4 of them. So guys, this is all for today. Thanks for watching.